But transferring, uh, yeah, you know the drill. Unless you don't, in which case, they're just going to say that over and over again. Zero, it's great to see you back safe. X just sent us uh, some new coordinates. Apparently they indicate where Wyle and Omega are. This may be the last battle. Uh, come talk to me when you're ready. Will do. But first, let's check on the other stuff we got. You know, just in case there's something really good. Nah, no, just the usual stuff. Anyway, Alouette, you doing okay? You don't have like some psychic, uh, unexplainable sixth senses or anything, right? Uh, Zero, I'm scared. Even when I hold on to this little guy, I'm still scared. Zero, please stay. Don't ever go away. Well... Eventually. Anyway, let's see. Menard? Menard is the coolest reploid in the universe. He is the kindest, smartest, most hardworking of them all. I do not recall entering this data into the system. Commencing shutdown. <laughs> Seal is a human girl with an empathetic connection to cyber elves. Also, she is a highly talented scientist who has devoted herself to research on energies. She recently completed the Seal system. Subjects of, uh, okay. Well, if that's that, then actually, wait, no, we do have some new cyber elves I want to check real quick. Wait, is that plus one to shield as in, like, the shield ability, like this thing? Shield boomerang? Or is that plus one as in, like, it lessens damage dealt, or I guess damage taken? You know what? I'm actually going to look that up real quick. Okay, yeah, I think that has to do with the shield weapon. So, let's go ahead and equip you instead. Okay, let's go with that. Who will you talk to? Seal, as always. Um, what do you need? Oh, yeah, first I should save. Now let's see what's up. Zero, I believe in you, but please don't bite off more than you can chew. What do you need? Wait, are you not... Oh, I guess we're talking to the operators then. Um, your orders, uh, select mission. Yeah. Uh, coordinate data obtained from the original X has been put, uh, it, it has been input completely. The coordinates lead to an abandoned research lab. According to our records, this is where Wilde used to carry out his research. It's right next to the place where you were sleeping, Zero. Ah, uh, all where it began. Wyla and Omega are there, aren't they? Zero, be careful. I will. Operator, is everything ready? Um, you can go at any time, Mr. Zero. Are you ready? Uh, yes. Yes, I am. Um... Mission assigned. All personnel, uh, prepare for transfer. All right, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Zero! And the music is... as tense as ever. Is this something? Ooh, hell. Um... All right, well, I guess we're not getting sub-tanks in this, then. Can double jump, can dash through some foes, water, boost running speed, slippery train. Okay. I just wanted to see. I couldn't remember fully, like, everything that we had. Then auto charge and boost weapon charge. Wait a minute. If we boost weapon charge speed and use the elf that, you know, gives us even more, or I guess even faster charge speed, that might be, uh... Hmm. I'm actually debating on giving it a shot. Oh, nope, there's nothing. Oh, what the hell is that? I'm oddly getting, uh... Oh, okay. We need to be careful about jumping too high and about fall... Oh, of course. <laughs> uh, I mean, we're at full health. It's not like it matters that much. 
Um... Ooh, oh, okay, okay. Just wanted to double check. Oh, and that one goes all the way. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. Maybe I should just try moving quickly through all of this. Oop, oop, okay. That's bad. But yeah, I think... I, I realize it's just a game, and... Oh... Ah, there we go. Again, it's still one of my favorite parts of these games. It's just the little hints of exploration. But yeah, even though it's just a health, and we could technically get unlimited of it due to that little elf up there, I just feel bad for wasting it, I guess. Not really sure why, though. No. Well... Here we go. <laughs> this is going to happen eventually. Which means I guess we will at least see whichever two bosses it was that, um, you know, I basically missed. Or I guess lost the footage of. What is the use of this century old junk in this new world? I'll cut you down and send you off to the Deadlands. Chicka taka chicka ta. Oh, you're going to be the mantis thing. Yeah. Oh, this guy was annoying. Okay, but he is weak to ice. And you know what? Auto charge. That way I can focus heavily on... I guess just trying to... Oh, god damn. Ooh. Well, so much for focusing on <laughs> trying to dodge. Uh, watch as I slice your old world and all your friends to ribbons, chica. That's the other thing, is because I haven't played this in quite a few months, I'm going to be really rusty. And the thing about this game is it's actually pretty damn difficult. You know, editing stuff is really easy because I can just basically edit out all my failed attempts, which I will probably end up doing. But it means that, like, in hindsight... It kind of, uh, I, I guess, makes it seem like it was nowhere near as difficult in the first place. Which is absolutely not the case. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. The elf saved me. Okay, we're done. How could I, the newest and greatest, lose to a century-old piece of junk? Impossible. No. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Well... Guess what? No mai wo mo shinderu. And there we go. Full health, quick save. And let's see who's next. Was this guy the cool one? I guess we'll see. Uh, you sure are a boisterous lout. Uh, not quietly next time. And where are your manners? You have no right to live in this world, uh, new world, so I'll see to it that you don't. Uh, no, I do not think you were the cool one. Okay, well. Are you the bullyable one? No, you are the incredibly annoying, you can't hit me one. Uh, one of these times. And we're done. Kick, 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 kick. You silly, inconsiderate barbarian. Oh, your type won't survive in the new world that's coming. Kick, 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 kick. Um. I mean, that's a lot coming from the guy who just exploded. I mean, I realize that in Mega Man, that doesn't really mean much in terms of, you know, living or dying, but... Oh my god, the cute one. You dunderhead. Lord Wilde's ideals were set in motion a century ago. Who are you to complain now? Get with the times. Do you want to get left behind? Um. Oh god, no. I think I remember this guy being really annoying. And fire is, I think, what the blue ones are weak to. 
Yeah. God, I miss Leviathan. <laughs> and Fefnir. Oh, I'm gonna destroy you. Oop. You can hurry as fast as you want, but you'll never catch up with history that has already passed you by. You'll be trailing behind Lord Wild forever. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing about history, though, is it repeats. And if you don't, well, learn from the past, you're really not going to make it very far into the future. Yeah, I love Lord Wild's new world. Oh, so hot. I won't let you get uh, in the way. I'll turn you to ashes. Which guy is this? The lizard guy. Who do we need for this? I think Thunder. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be so easy. <laughs> Unless I'm reckless. Okay, give me that. That way I can be reckless. Ah, hot! So hot! Oh, I hope you writhe in pain. Along, uh, alone in the new world. Yeah. Um, I'd say no you, but you're kind of already dead, so... Yeah. I don't remember who the other bosses are. Oh. Ooh, free health. Okay, so for this one, we should probably use the... Ignore Slippery Terrain. Oh, right, but that means we don't have double jump anymore. Excuse me. Okay. I like that, like... That kind of dire pulsing sound. <laughs> it's actually, I don't know, it's kind of cool. Or not sound, but like how the music has that like really dire tone or I guess atmosphere, whatever you want to call it to it. I have a really big soft spot for music, so yeah. And the Mega Man games have always been really, really good when it comes to music. Also, it's really funny because... The more I play into uh, the Zero series specifically, the more I actually see a lot of inspiration for, or maybe not inspiration, but I see where they got like a lot of the ideas for um, uh, like 20XX and 30XX. Actually, I kind of want to start trying to stream those. Just do like, I don't know, like a daily mission a day. Maybe, like, stream it or something early in the morning. I, I really am not 100% sure what to do with them, but I want to do something because those games are a lot of fun. And like that. It's boss time. Oh, actually, wait, no. It's probably just going to be the next four bosses. Yeah. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Save. <laughs> That'd be really, really bad. I am the guard dog of Hades. Lord Weil instructed me to not let you in. I'll bite you to chunks. Come and get it. No. This is the other really annoying guy. Well, let's start by finding his weakness. And because he's blue, I'm going to go out on a limb and say it might be fire... Oh, God. I don't think it's fire. Oh, my God, stop. There's not enough, enough meat on your bones. I'm still hungry. Actually, there shouldn't be any meat on Zero's bones because he's a robot. No, no, no. We're done. How did this happen? Why can't I bite you to chunks? 
Oh, why do I hurt all over again? Ow! Uh, probably because you are exploding. I, uh... Can't really speak from experience, and to be honest, I hope to never ex speak uh, from experience with that one. <laughs> so you're back, back again, ready to be broken. <laughs> I'll do it, I don't mind. <laughs> right, the tentacle monster. All right, well, that did nothing, so let's try the ice. It is, in fact, ice. <laughs> All right. Well, if you're just going to keep doing that, then. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, health, please. Okay, no, we're done. <laughs> you broke me, but you won't be able to break Omega. I guarantee you that. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I'm gonna, you know, doubt you for a moment there. I'm sure we'll break Omega just fine. I actually almost said something that... I'm pretty certain I know what Omega is. <laughs> <laughs> First thievery, and now unlawful entry. How outrageous. Uh, there's no mercy for those who disrupt the order. I sentence you to death. Cool. <laughs> yeah, I like his little munchkin stance. All right, you're probably going to be fire? Actually, no, no. Green is usually thunder. Or not. Okay. Well, sometimes you just got to play around with it then. Yeah, it's absolutely fire. <laughs> Ooh, damn. Ooh. Oh, buddy, buddy. Health, pl oh, I think he already dropped health. Ooh, give me that. Gotta get that. That was not worth it. Damn it. Huh. Uh, those who disrupt Lord, uh, Lord Wiles, uh, whatever, must face my wrath. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. I'm trying to remember the voice. It's that kid in Shrek. I think it was like the fourth one. He's just like, do the roar. Like that thing. That's like the voice that comes to my head when I saw him at first. I just can't think of like exactly how it goes. Anyway, it's fire time. Ooh. Got some reach on those. <laughs> okay, yeah, now that I have a bit of a better grasp for his, uh, uh, whatever, this should be so much easier. Yeah, just like that. Uh, what is this? You, you dare to judge? What is this? You dare to defy my judgment? Lord Wild, strike down this foolish one. Arrgh. How about no you? Except instead of while, it's just zero. Because... Well, I know I've joked about it previously, but Zero is quite literally just, like, basically the Reaper for robots. What are you doing in a place like this, little boy? It's your bedtime. You mustn't see the world that lies ahead, little boy. Oh, you mustn't survive to see it. Uh, no you. I have no memory of this. Um, if you're... I feel... Fire is usually... Oh, God. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's totally it. Oh, God. How do I dodge that? Uh, I don't expect that you'll wake again. And we're done, thank God. Uh, no need to throw a tantrum. 
All your struggles will be in vain. That's right. You're no hero, and you're no god of destruction either. There's nothing you can do. Ah! Yeah, the god of destruction was Anubis, I believe. And, uh, well, <laughs> we killed him all the same. All right, so... What lies beyond? God, I do really miss the chain rod, though. The whole grappling thing was really, really cool. Ooh, spikes. Uh, uh, we're going to have to be really careful, aren't we? Yes. Yes, we are. Okay. Oh, really? Where? Okay, no, no. We got a free pass then. And uh, you know what? We're full health. It doesn't matter. <laughs> we, we don't need every bit of health. <laughs> Having fun playing hero, hmm, Zero? You do understand, don't you? That I have no time for your petty games. So, let's finish this once and for all, shall we? <laughs> How pitiful! Of course, a reploid like you would never understand. The joy of ruling all that you see. Only a human could possibly understand. A uh, human? That's right. I'm a bona fide human. The creator of the reploids. A human being. Wait, Dr. Kane? The desire for power, the joy of making everything work for you. Oh, you have no way of experiencing this without a, hu a human brain. It is the ultimate joy. No mere reploid could ever understand. I bet most decent humans wouldn't understand either. You look just like another maverick to me. All I gotta do is dispose of you, like any other maverick. <laughs> Good, good. An excellent little speech, Zero. You must feel great, right? Uh... I remember I gave Omega, like, some joke voice. It's like, oh, oh, Zero. Oh, you are a fun guy, Zero. I'd like to play some more, but it's time we parted. Oh, I have some more fun surprises left in store for you. Enjoy them to the last, Zero. All right, so that does all right. For some reason, I feel like he's going to have, like, partial immunity to everything. So, like, it probably doesn't really matter what we hit him with. Ooh, hey, if you didn't, he did. And cool, I can just skip straight forward then. Okay. Ooh. Okay, it's not ju just like giant lasers then. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I guess I can't hurt him while that's happening. Or maybe I can. Oh, okay. The last one sends projectiles out then. Okay. Uh, okay, no, no, we're fine. I'm expecting him to, like, well, pull out some, like, crazy other moves. Wait, is that it? Grr, rar. <laughs> Not bad, Zero. But Omega's true power is much greater than you've been led to expect. Go, get him, Omega. Release the power of the Dark Elves. Grr, <laughs> I like the idea of, like, the final... Oh, sweet Jesus, what is this? I like the idea of... Oh. Okay. This is like some Sigma face mode. Is that even doing anything? Oh, God, okay. What is this? Oh, oh, okay. 
Uh, you know what? We're doing all right damage. Hey there, little elf, if you'd like to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh, this is going to be bad. Okay, well, little elf, if you'd like to keep dropping health, but like on me, not on him. <laughs> that would be awesome. Oh, God. But yeah, this reminds me a lot of like the, uh, in the Mega Man X4 Sigma fight, I think it was like the third phase, how it just has like that big weird face on the ground, or I guess to a much less, uh, at least for me, a much less memorable extent, the, uh, the big Sigma face in X6. Uh, God, I hated that one. And there we go. Still have full health. Again, grr, rar, yeah. <laughs> we literally just read all of that. But now, for the uh, face battle. Okay, I just need to remember to have double jump and the dash jump when he does that. Ooh, ooh, I didn't realize that. I thought that had to return to him. I also need to remember that wherever he fires first is safe. Oh, damn. All right, little buddy, if you would like to give me the health and not the endless void below him. Oh, no. I can avoid that, right? I need that. Okay. Wait for that to go away. Okay, cool. Again, gonna have to... Damn it. Gonna have to play it a little smart if I can. Okay. Ooh. Close. Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh. Yeah, unfortunately, if that first one hits me, there's not really much I can do about that. The first one is the big toss-up. Actually, I guess I could just get airborne. Even if it's only just for a split second. All right, back to this phase. Oh, 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 I thought that was the the thing that killed me last time. Nope, but this is. Okay, what are you doing? Ah, uh, the big ball, okay. Ooh, okay. Close. And of course the health goes right down the thing. Okay, cool. I've got the timing down for that, mostly. Ooh, okay. God, that one is actually a really, really weird one to... Ooh, ooh, okay. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> it's a really, really weird one to time. Damn, whatever. We're basically full health. Ooh, okay. And we're good. Yeah, I actually think the reason why... I'm doing so much damage is because of that plus one to the sword that I had. Oh, oh, that was close. I need to pay a lot. Damn it. Okay. I think one more good hit. Okay. Now where's phase three? And we're back here. Is this going to be the significance of it? What, what is this place? You know what it is. This is where I was sleeping. <laughs> Excellent zero. Okay, so real quick, I will say this. I'm not going to say it outright. But I think there's some significance why Omega had a sword and kind of the big long hair. Because there might be another character in, well, let's just say in the history of Mega Man, who's had both of those things. Who we may or may not possibly be playing as. Um, let's see. Your power is extraordinary for a mere fake. Fake.
but I'm pretty certain that all the stuff that they've said about, you know, Zero being a fake and like that not being his original body, I think it's because the Omega probably is his original body. Also, that organ. Damn. <laughs> you, the legendary Reploid. Oh, you fool. Those resistant losers just decided to call the Reploid they found Zero for some reason. You may be Zero in some way, but you are still merely a copy. You are no legendary hero at all. You're just a reproduction. <laughs> oh, you thought you were a hero all along, didn't you? Never suspecting that you were a mere copy. What a joke. And there goes my phone, of course. Omega himself is the one and only original Zero. Yeah, had a hunch. You're just a copy of him. The original Zero? Why is he your slave then? Huh. He's a bloodthirsty god of destruction. All I did was upgrade him to draw out all of his power. All right, Omega, or should I say original Zero? Time to wake this pitiful fake from a century-long dream. Oh, and there's the Giga attack because, oh, damn. Oh, oh. Oh, he's using, like, all of the X4 abilities, too. Oh, damn. Please tell me that we actually get to start from there. No! All right, well. I guess the other forms weren't that bad. I'm assuming this is the final boss. So... I can't really say I'm too worried. I just might actually have to pick this up later because, uh, yeah, I need to be somewhere kind of soon. Are you fucking kidding me? Damn. I do kind of like how this form has like the imagery of like zero on one side and then Mega Man on the other, or I guess X on the other. Ooh, ooh, okay, we're fine. Ah, I meant to get back to full health. Okay. Now the thing that sucks is this immediately kicks him off the, ah, damn, yeah. Off the side of the screen. Okay, I'm gonna give this one more try. <laughs> And then, uh, I actually have to, I have to go get ready for, oh god, oh god, stuff. Oh, he has Zero's original, like, one, two, three. Oh, God, except for when he charges up. God damn. Maybe I need to use the Buster. I mean, either way, I'll figure it out later, because I just don't have the time at the moment. All right, me. It's time to die. Oh. Oh, 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 okay, okay, ah. Oh, oh, wait, why do you get the buster? It's also fairly obvious that I am not supposed to, <laughs> I'm not supposed to get in a sword fight with myself because he's clearly better. But I'm feeling like being stubborn, so I'm going to do exactly that. Oh, hey, buddy, don't do that. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, God, he is better than me in every way. No, no, no. He can combo me. Actually, I'm kind of thinking maybe... Which one is it? No recoil when hit might actually be kind of good. Of course, I'm going to have to actually remember to change it once we get to him, but, eh, you know, I'll forget when it matters the most. Okay, let's see. Oh, wait, no, no, no. This one. God, oh, fuck me. <laughs> Part of me is actually thinking that, you know what? I might, maybe, just say screw it. And start using all of these guys. <laughs> okay, I need to remember that we have these guys that will basically reduce the boss's vitality. Also, I don't want to save because I think I accidentally put a bunch of the crystals into the wrong guys. So, we'll see how this goes. Okay, this guy, I can actually dodge it endlessly, so I just want to get back up to full health. And we're good. Yeah, this is the thing, is I can very easily get through the first two stages. Actually, the second one is a little bit more iffy, just because, well, mainly that attack, and then ah, that one. It's kind of hard to know when they'll start. Oh, okay. Yeah, the best bet is just to be airborne, but the other one will actually kind of punish you. And a lot of times, I'm not really sure which one is which. I'm sure there's probably a tell somewhere, but, well, I don't know it. Okay. And then, ah, uh, yeah, this is the other one. I I'm just not used to the timing on it. And are you kidding me? Okay. Are you crap the hell? <laughs> Dude. All right, fine. I guess I'll just have to kill myself out of rage. Okay, let's see if this works. Half the boss's vitality. Oh, hell yeah, it works. <laughs> well, you know what? I was really afraid that because it was a final boss, it wouldn't have any effect. But I feel like because he is... Uh, how do you say this? Uh, me, but better in every way. And also, you know, kind of infected with the uh, Dark Elf whatever. Or at least under his influence. I feel like it's rather fitting that we actually use these guys. Oh, oh. Okay, avoid the rocks. Oh, oh, well, you know, <laughs> you know, <laughs> we have plenty of these guys. Uh, no, 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 we're not doing the eight. We're doing the full heal. Now, as long as he doesn't do the one-shot attack... Ooh, we should be fine. Oh, my God, I thought I just died. Okay, we're done. I might have done that in the cheapest way possible. But you know what? I did it with the sword. Actually, uh, no, no, I think... Did I get the final kill with the sword? I have no idea. Anyway, it doesn't matter, because I believe that's the end of the game. So, what is this? 200 crystals? 
How useful. That's, oh, truly. Now that the game is over, that's exactly what I needed. <clears throat> you plan to reactivate Omega? Yeah. <laughs> Watch, but don't interfere. Don't forget, hold on to the lives of all humans and reploids in my ha Oh. I hold on to the lives and all human. I hold on to the lives of all humans and reploids in my hand. <sighs> Zero, Zero, what are you doing? Hurry, stand up. <gasps> I was wondering if these guys would appear. Hey, I'm here to get a little payback, Omega. I was so worried these guys were dead. Time to straighten up the record. You guys, the whale's trying to bluff you. He can't do anything in his current state. Dark Elf! Shut them up! Zero! What is it? What is it, Dark Elf? Her. The Dark Elf's curse is fading. Who's that? Uh, X? That's right. That's right, Whale. Just like a century ago, I worked with the Zero to defeat this Omega then. And we saved the world from your greedy clutches. Just like... a century ago? The defeated Omega is using your original body. That's all. Your current body may be a copy, but your heart is the real thing. Alright, now. Alright, now's the time. While the Dark Elf's power is weak, time to finish what you started a century ago, Zero. Zero, don't do it! That's your original body! Don't you feel any attachment? Um... Oh, God, where do we even start with this? <laughs> because first of all... And by the way, potentially heavy spoilers for the original, you know... Actually, not even the original series, the X series. Uh, Zero dies in Mega Man X1 because his body is too damaged to repair. Mega Man X2, they revive him, using basically scavenged pieces to rebuild him. Mega Man X3, if you, well, play as Zero and die, he's just dead, period. Mega Man X5, well, depending on which ending you get, everyone dies. So, the fact that you're saying this is the original Zero body, I'm already gonna call BS. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I don't think Zero cares at this point. Are you really prepared to spend the rest of your life in that cheap fake? You can do it. You know what's truly important. Go on, Zero. Oh, buddy. Get fucked. Oh, wait, why can't I attack? Wait. Guys? Why can't I... Oh. <laughs> I think the controls reverted to whatever the default was, because that's not what I had it set to. Z zero Wake up, Zero! Can you hear me, Zero? My energy, my energy is almost all spent. I can't, I can't stay in this world much longer. Zero? I want to leave this world in your care. The threat Wile represents has not left this world. I want you to protect humans and reploids. Z Zero, you can do it. You, you can. Zero, wake up. Zero. Oh, what a relief. I was so worried about you. Mr. Zero, you've regained consciousness. Oh, what a relief. Hey, everyone, Mr. Zero's awake. He's all right. 
Where, where is this? The Resistance base? Who could have... Zero. Dark Elf? Wait, no. You are... Uh, she brought you back here. Z Zero. What a warm, gentle light. Mother Elf. Has Wild's curse been broken? Shouldn't we follow her? She's finally free. There's still Wile, but let's let her go in peace for now. Why? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I know there's a fourth game, so obviously they need a plot for it. But why? X told me, X told me about you, Zero. Really? I know you're not worried about a thing, but... Huh? Even if your body is a copy, as long as your heart is your own, you are Zero. The one and only Zero. Seal. Thank you. Z Zero? It's just me. I... I am... Zero. And there we go. You know, that actually feels like it'd be a really, really good wrapping up point for the Zero series. I mean, I have no idea what comes up in... Uh, I guess zero three, or no, uh, zero four. But this feels oddly complete in a way. It's, I don't know, it's kind of weird to explain, I guess. I mean, you know, X did his whole like, oh yeah, I'm gonna leave this world thing, but he's kind of already done that before. So, in a weird way, like, nothing is actually new, but it feels... I don't know. It feels like everything is kind of at peace, I guess. I mean, you know, obviously there's Wile, who's out there probably doing something horrible. And there's the Mother Elf, which, uh, you know, I don't really have much faith for in terms of not returning to the whole Dark Elf thing. And not to mention there could, uh, you know, easily be the X copies, which we already know one is out there. The one who basically, you know, was taken under control by Wile and then basically handed over control to him. So, I mean, yeah, there are, I guess, some loose ends. I don't know. It, it, it just feels like it would be a really good ending point. I don't know if that makes any sense. It's kind of like sometimes game series go on for a really long time. Or even movies, TV shows. You know, like, there should have been an end at some point. But they kind of just keep making them. And I think if there wasn't an X, or I guess a, a Mega Man Zero Four, I'd be pretty happy with this. I mean, I'm still going to go play it right after this. But it's kind of like... I don't know. You can tell that there is still going to be conflict after this story ends. But I feel like when it comes to Mega Man, that's kind of the point. There isn't just some, you know, big bad boss that you beat and then suddenly everything's at peace. It's just a long, never-ending conflict that, well, just keeps dragging on. Which, I mean, is, you know, life, really. Uh, play hard mode by holding the LB button. Uh, how about no? <laughs> Zero's minigame added. 
Okay, save? Uh, absolutely.